Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, just to see a piece, just a piece of what Google's offering, oh, what Google's offering on today's page. So this is what Google's offering, G-M-O, G-M-O. What would be this? Would it be upside down? Would it be a jack? Would it say J-O-3? Would it say J-O-E upside down? Or would it say go? What would it say? Would it be upside down like this? So what would it be saying? As you can see on the end over here, it's like a musical note. It's connected to this, but there's only this dark space. She sings. She holds open one hand, close one hand. She has the same color of her hair. She has a blue dress with a, bl a, a blue s silver outlet, and it says Mary Calla's 90th birthday. Well, that stands for... Uh, the birthdays of the 90th, maybe, who is she? And it also says, call us. Maria, call us, 90th birthday, because there's two other guys in the presidency are looking for their 90th birthday. If you take a look, you see what this is? Caesar, the son, and then over here, the guy, what he's wearing, the V for victory, the U over here, they're all wearing something lit up in their shirts. She's dark. He's got bright. You've got to figure out what it is. Again, if you take a look, the same thing as here is here. Now, this sun could be the sun of China. I don't know. And if you look up top, one, two, three. So we have to make whatever this is up here, whatever the word is up here, whatever the curtain holds open on one side of the G, and it's all inside this curtain. Can you see the stand for the NHL? See the way it's holding on to it? It's holding on two sides. So I'm not sure what this is, but I'm just letting you know that, let me tell you one thing, this is starting to move very fast in my mind. Raphael 7286 in the constellation of Pegasus. There were other things. I was watching this, I don't know what you call them, they wear all that sexy outfit stuff, and there was one holding the split moons of Hurley, and I was thinking, it was all about Venus. Okay, that show was all about Venus. The Venus moon is the female. At the same time, the quarter moons. We might be looking at quarter moons because Mars has two moons and Earth has one moon. So is it possible that man has a single moon and Venus has a double moon as the head on every single person is automatically connected with the female egg? But we come out in Mars. Why? Because we have two more quarters down below beneath our legs. So I'm not sure what else this is. I was watching this video I was watching this video really fast, and it showed Mark Snowden, okay, being the 121st day or the 120-something day of the year, in, in which we've already passed that this year, and it's like he's in on the scam of some sort, a scam that went wrong, and it shows in its rotation, okay, that time is coming to um, an end. You know, it was one of these uh, things I saw online, and it showed how time was coming to an end. Is I really can't tell you, show you the numbers. I know what the numbers are in my own vision. I know 702, 516, 813. I know when you get 813, you've got it all because that's a total of 104. 8 times 30 is 240. 8 times 1 is 8 is 248. 8 equals to 196. 4 times 8 and 4 plus 8 is the 44 space we are in right now. And when I saw it on there, it calculates the zero time of Jesus. 702 which is Raish, which is B-A-R. Why is it B-A-R or T-O-G? Toga, go to, Toga. Why? Because it took two and seven beta to create nine. Now, you may not understand it. Planet Ison, the moon, all kinds of realities. One other thing to look at is you have to remember that the only way to make seven is with four and three. If you make seven with four and three, then you can use three and three and four and two to make six. And now that you made six, the next way to make five is four and one and three and two. The next way to make four is one and four and two and two. And the way to make three, uh, in order to make three and two, you need one and one and one and two. There's no other way to make, you cannot make two any other way but one and one. You can't make two any, this any other way than two and two. And then these all the way to the top. Now, although there's five and two and six, we do not use the five or six because we don't go anything over four. 
We go one, two, three, four, two and two. We have two groups, and that's all we want. The center of the group will be a piece of all the groups. So this is the only thing you can do, and it works out to seven and two, first and last, is nine. It works out to six and three, first and last is nine. It works out to four and six is ten. Ten. One plus six is seven. So you end up with seven. Where are the numbers? I changed all the oh, these numbers are right here. Seven, nine, nine, seven. Those are the three little pigs. Nine and seven is sixteen. Nine and seven is sixteen. One and six is seven. 7 between 7 will equal 5. You'll go 9. Forget about the first and last 9. will be 959. Nine. This is what it comes out to. E-I-E-I-O, the Einstein theory. It's because what comes in between that is pure is inside the dice cubes or inside the cards. These are in the dice cubes. Nothing in the dice cube says 7. So you have to take a stand on what you can have. And the closest you can have is the four corners and this. These are the only two to get into the game. This God creates with these two here. After that, the game begins. There is no five without having this three. There is no two without, there is a two, but you need this four to enter into the game. So this is the seven that comes in. So I eliminate six and one, and I get six from three and three and four and two. And I eliminate that the five completion, which would give me five and four is nine. When I get my five and four by a combination of four and three and one on one. If we understood that. Um, at the same time, I was seeing something in this thing, and it said Century Hotel. And then I started looking up. Most of the Century Hotels I found were down in Asia. So this Army Rotation, R-O-T-C-O, seems like there's going to be an Army Switch, in which is a payoff for bringing goods and supplies from other countries to hold them at bay when they're going to need their top security to come in and securitize the area. Snowden... Okay, too many things that say it's a ploy. He, what has he actually done for us? What has he said? What has he given us? How does he do this? Why didn't he just make it? Why does he hide and he doesn't speak? Or does he speak and not enough of us hear? How is it that, that, that that's happening? Right? If it was me, you'd think as fast as you could before anything starts to get whatever the word had to be, you get it out. And if you're really high security, I think you should be protected from wherever you go. I'm looking through a few pages to see what there is. December 8th, pines and needles are the injections that man has got. The debit machine marks all your finger. We're not going to go there right now. July is ugly. Um, white, ice, electronic, blue, and yellow transmission. What is the yellow? Is it a urine? Is it the penicillin inside our bodies? Is it the piss? What carries in the piss? What is it about the salts? We must learn about the salts. I have to know more about the salts because they're giving me a lot of them in a blue pill. And I never did like it since day one. One, two, three. Two, three, four. Three, four, five. Four, five, six. Now you have to stop. Actually, you had to stop on 3, 4, 5 because you can't count from the second area. Um, 7 is Uranus. 6 is Saturn. 1 is Mercury. 1 Mercury and 6 Saturn is the same thing as, as 6 Saturn and 7 Uranus. They connect together on the dice. So you are therefore split apart and you are not together. You must be Venus and Jupiter in order to become Earth because Earth is in the word Jupiter. So you must become Venus and Jupiter, or you must be part Jupiter and Neptune. Part of us is always in the water. The A, that's a V, that's upside down, is because it's, it's into your crown. The other one is an A. We don't have to say anything about it because it crosses your ears. The wind goes through and an automatic, automatic ding, ding, ding. You're an angel. You either like this or like this. One is a V, one is an A. The other one, when it's sitting down, when it's sitting down on its feet, when it looks like an A, it's like this. So it shows your feet on the ground. Otherwise, it shows you upside down or you're on the ground smoking some kind of peace pipe. Hmm. Um, to vire is to turn around. Um, they say that in February. Is it a month to turn around because it says vire? And it says also Fere, which means the giant. 
It also means the train tracks inside the word of February, in which the Spanish, I think, would say Febrie as Febrie, because they would change the B for a V or the V for a B. So now that we connect, we must connect Neptune to Uranus and Uranus to Venus, but we go around, around in life, being six men of the four and four worlds, partial and partake within Neptune and Mars moons connected inside of Saturn, which is either in Saturn or it's a corner inside the planet of Jupiter, unless Jupiter is completely a separate entity which runs the totalities of the show. So if there were two houses, I would say, hey, let's go across the street inside the house of Jupiter. No, let's go across the street inside the house of Saturn. So no matter what happens, and I've seen 10 all over the place, say 10, because you're in the house of 10, you're in the house of Plato, and you're inside probably a corner of Jupiter inside of Saturn, both owned by the same entity. So no matter what goes on, that bad black sheep doesn't have to scream very long. Now there was a question. July, August, September, October, November, says Jason. It also says, I am ugly, Augustine, the winds of the scepter, which is seven, and October, which is eight. But one of my brother-in-law says to me, how come July is seven and August is eight, when October says octagon eight? The octagon eight of October is in the tenth month, one, oh, and eight. It is division, and it holds this way and this way of both sides of who it is. It holds Neptune and Venus inside of it, as eight and two is ten, nine and two is eleven. 9 and 3 is 12. You have December and the day my son is born. Just works out so perfectly. So why is August representing of which month? July represents 7. August the 8th month could represent the 4th month because it also says April. August can also represent, as it's the 8th month, can represent the 7 upside down as the 8th card because 8 and 4 are actually the same thing. It has the U inside of it as 21721, which is 3737, which is 1331, which is 11 times 11 times 11, which means absolutely nothing. But the August is a ring. It is the angel spirit. It is the same thing as October, but October retains the nine lives of the cat. It's inside of your birth, where August is just an expression of the heavens. October is the heavens with inside your mind. The scepter is the scepter that man has and his heart beats. July, August is like September, October. Before you leave one world into the next world, your heart is beating with spirit. It is the angel. It is the V for life. Seven and eight is 15 is the egg, what came out of the egg. And ninth month and tenth month is 19. For man on the moon is the nine birth and the ten world of the five and five of man angel up and man angel down because J is a U upside down. It's a hook and it's the same thing you can actually see in this world. We're all GMOs, but different kinds of GMOs. Anyways, the same thing is what I was telling you right now. Jason, a sound of Ison. A gust of wind, an angel, a seafarer for seven. Ice, the ice is on. Jason, ice on. I am the angel spirit. October, November, octagon, neutral, lization of creation. Over to December 12, January 1 makes 1, 2, 2, 1, 2. 2, 1, 1, 2 makes 33 creation. I am the ice on that comes in. I am the July, June, July, June, and January. I am the Joker. I am Ja. The tenth and first letter as eleven, spirit, angel, and man. I have to keep looking into my book. I am Jason. I am ice on. I'm going to have to read you this paper from over here. It says Jupiter, J. July, August, September, October, jazz, the, da, the jazz is on, the DJ is in, they're on MM and FM, watch out for FEMA, as the junior angel of Ison, or the ace, is back in the house, and it brings an angel to, for a Jew, because those are the months, all I did is play Ison, Jason, in French, the J sounds like a G, 
So it would right away it would say G son. So then it would say the G son is in. That means the G, the gateway, the doorway is open. Now how much time is left? I son is here. July, August, September, October. Um, the reason now, if you take the two months again of August and October, it's eighteen. Eighteen is the H. Eighteen as the tenth letter is the J. They're both from the A family. It says H J or Jashe, Jashe, Jash, Jash, Jash. J Actually, it would say Jafar because the R is also in the same family. Jason, J A S O N, Jason D for December. D D J. J A, the sound of S is E S, it would say J S N. Essen, Essen, son, son of O N D, the second son of God. Oh my God, it's right here, O N D. O N D, it's the second son of God. Je comes, the second. Why? You can also look this as the, as the zone or the end zone because an N, remember, anything that is an N, can also be a two. At the same time, you can turn it and to be a Z. So what are we trying to put together? December, D and E, can also say two. It can also say J inside of the French. Okay? The roar of the ocean, the roar of the lions. What is the circle of life? It might just be the roar of the oceans that kept us. All the water that kept us together and apart. If we would move, move all the islands back together again and move away the oceans, we wouldn't be so far from everybody else, would we? Would we? Would we be using up actually more room if we all moved closer together and moved away the waters? I think we'd be a couple of thousand miles, give or take. Anyways, Raphael 7286 in a constellation of Pegasus. January and all the initials for the month they all add up to 116. If you take away the three J's, you have 86. If you keep the three J's and you take away the two M's, you're taking away 26. You now have 90. So once you start taking away and adding, you'll see what's left over. We all know October, the O initial does not repeat. The S initial does not repeat. The N initial does not repeat. The D initial does not repeat. The J does. The F initial does not repeat. Uh, then it's after February is March, April, May, June, July, August. They all repeat. So all we're left over with initials right here is the sixth son of D. The son of day. God's son of day. That's what it says. These are the initials not used. The sound, the owns, the vibrations, the face of man, this is, the, this is where we start. September, October, November. Sun. Sun, DF. Well, I don't like to say it that way because that's the, my son's initials. So, the Son of God. What does it mean, the Son of God? I mean, that means if it was, if it was like I'm the God to my son, so we are all the fathers to the sons of who is our father, he is our God. Because we go to him for the better, the only person you can actually approach. Is this ND? Ending? Forget about this F. Let's say we go F son. Let's say we say death. Son? Oh, that's where it is. S O N D F. Okay, okay, okay. Let me write this down. Let me write this down. S. S O N D F. Now D in sound is an E, and F is an is an is an E. But if you have two E's, you can put an A. So now you have death. Okay. Now you have the sun. Okay, which is a S or it can actually just say fifty. Fifty north. Sun. Death, 50, north. Death. 
Now we've got September with an R. October with an R. December with an R. Now we have February. Is there a doctor in the house? D and R combination? Is there gold in the house? Is there a spirit angel connection? SARS, SOR, SARADAR, SARADAR. I don't know what it is. Radar. Sonar radar. Wow. Wow. I don't know, but sonar radar. When you take the initials, the initial F for February, okay, I still would have to play with this more. Right now, it's take the, the 50 north. The sonar radar is coming down towards the 50 north. And that's where I see that star every single day. Anyways, like I said, the more you play and create everything as an instrument of being instrumental, then the more the vibrations, and you're going to say one day, oh, look, what a coincidence. Yesterday, somebody spoke about Nibiru, and today, they're negating it. They're all real. And some of the stars that are coming are the stars inside our mind. The reflection, reality of the coming of the truth of the times of the reality that we should have been in, that we are going to be scared of because it's going to be so new and so amazing. The problem is, at which point will we all notice and at what point will my actuality be reality before it's extinct because too much time has passed by? You will know. Somehow I noticed when I did and I'm... Thank you for watching this video. Raphael 7286 in the constellation of Pegasus. Check out where Pegasus is. Maybe that'll tell us something. Why don't we check out the diagonal point of Pegasus and make a three-point sky out of Pegasus. Down to her left, up to the center, up to the right, and pinpoint Pegasus and box, keep her in the corner and box everything in. Let's see where she ends up. Maybe she's a focal point. She could be. She's in the corner. So anyways, thank you for watching. Oh, look what I just saw at the end. Look at this. That star. I didn't see these two quarter moons. This is a T. T-O-L-L. -L. You pay the toll. You pay the goal. You see the way it, it closed it here? It was a, it's a G. And at the same thing, it's an O. At the same time, it has the three curves for an E. It's G-O-E. G-O-E-M something... Anyways, whatever it is, play with it. This is what we're here for. Sorry to interrupt your 20 minutes. Thank you for watching.